Closing ceremony. I'm Savannah Collins, the league reporter. Fans of women's pro basketball know that there is far more talent than there are roster spots, which is one of the many things that has made the launch of AU Hoops so special. It created the opportunity for athletes to stay home and play in front of family and friends as a pro. Others return to the court for the first time in years, and we are so happy to have seen you hoop again. Absolutely. <laughs> and then we have the athletes who made themselves known this season, and you are leaving here with a newfound ba fan base that is so excited to cheer you on throughout your career. So now it is time to celebrate your accomplishments in the first season of spectacular lockdown defense, buzzer beaters, dynamic duos, and more. Joining me here on the court, welcome Athletes Unlimited co-founder, Jonathan Soros. And our CEO and co-founder, John Patrickoff. Also with us, we have the Athletes Unlimited Player Executive Committee for Basketball, the chairperson, Sydney Colson, <laughs> along with members, Ty Young, Jantel Lavender, Tasha Cloud, and Tiana Hawkins. <laughs> to start things off tonight, I welcome up Jonathan Soros. Thank you. I think everybody's exhausted. Well, at least you guys are exhausted. We're doing fine. But, uh, so I'm just going to say a very quick congratulations to everybody for an incredible, uh, incredible inaugural, inaugural season of basketball. Uh, we all had no doubt that there was appetite for more great basketball right here in the US. And I think we heard from everybody who was following and tweeting and watching on TV that they all agree. So this was an incredible success and congratulations to all of you. You all put it all on the court from the very first game we played to triple overtime tonight. Unbelievable way to finish the season. It, it's, been, it's been so much fun to watch, um, but also personally it's been an honor to do this with you and to be able to tell your stories. So I want to thank you all. I want to thank you for your talent. I want to thank you for sharing with each other and sharing with us and sharing with everybody's here and out there watching. Congratulations. What an awesome team. Thank you. Next, please welcome up CEO John Patrickoff. As I think everyone has now seen, this is not a league about making small changes to things that existed before. We're about imagining a future for which there's no model and for which there are boundless possibilities. The process of imagining the future involves all of us. You, the athletes, our staff at Athletes Unlimited, and importantly, the fans and family here tonight and watching at home. We are all in this together. In order to succeed in such an environment, you need a lot of people to buy in and be willing to take a risk. I want to thank those people who have gotten us to this point and with whom I'm excited to keep going forward. First, my co-founder, Jonathan Soros. So much of what you see here in Athletes Unlimited was in his head years before we started. And along with his creativity and imagination, he's been a constant source of stability and calm for all of us. Second, I want to thank Kristen Miles and Eileen Hauser. They're an incredible duo who's worked tirelessly to bring AU basketball to life. They've truly exemplified the reality that while you may able to be able to go faster alone, you can go further together. Third, the entire staff and crew. I want to call out the people who worked so hard to transform this building into what players and fans have experienced over the past five weeks. I can tell you when we walked in here back in November, it didn't look like this. And as well, the team that has captured the incredible content and storytelling you've seen on broadcasts and our digital channels. You guys are amazing. Fourth, I want to thank the entire women's basketball community around the world. This season has not been about or, it's been about and, and you have made that possible. 
This is an important lesson in life. Too many people want to force competition where it doesn't exist. Make people, and especially women athletes, make or choices. AU is about and, and the women's basketball community has fully embraced that. Fifth, the families and loved ones of the athletes and staff that make sacrifices and support us to make this league possible. You're the unsung heroes, and we appreciate you. And finally, to you, the athletes of Athletes Unlimited Basketball. You deserve this league and so much more. Your talents on and off the court, the example you set for so many, and the perseverance and persistence you have exhibited are gifts that you've shared with us, and we are better because of it. Now as we close season one, there'll be a few days of rest, but then our work at Athletes Unlimited will turn to the future, to what lies ahead, to the possibilities. Join us in shaping that future, imagining the possibilities, and making them a reality. And finally, to speak on behalf of the Player Executive Committee, Sydney Colson. Thank you, thank you. Um, congratulations on an incredible first season, y'all. We really did that. We did it, we did it, we did it, we did it, we did it. Um, we all made this happen, y'all, from our co-founders, to our staff, to our facilitators, who were amazing for us, to the fans. Um, I really don't think we could have envisioned this being any better than it was. I mean, the entire experience. Uh, Athletes Unlimited really took care of us from our living situation, to making sure that we had a nice facility to play in, to making sure that we just felt taken care of, and we really appreciate y'all for that. So many players came here and rediscovered their love for the game. They showcased their talent and had opportunities to receive more basketball opportunities. Um, and some people, like myself, felt so freed and liberated here at AU in this experience that they realized that they're not even American, and they've been suppressing their real voice. So thank you, AU, for helping me to realize who I truly am. Uh, <laughs> oh, and to add another twist, John and Jonathan, I spoke to all the players. They can vouch. We decided that this was such an amazing experience that actually this isn't the closing ceremony, and we will be continuing next weekend. So rebook our rooms. Get the gym again. We running it back another five weeks. Period. <laughs> Courtney, Courtney, believe it. Believe it. <laughs> but seriously, thank you, John and Jonathan. Uh, y'all changed so many of our lives by following through on a dream that y'all had. And um, I absolutely cannot wait for next season. Players and fans, let's please make sure that we support all the other sports and athletes unlimited. And uh, I'm not done. I'm not done. <laughs> I'm not done. And when we come back for season two, y'all, let's make it just as memorable and make every moment count. <laughs> Does anybody do it quite like Sydney Colson? <laughs> All right, it's time for what we've been waiting for. It's time to present the awards. So first, we're gonna start off with the Sportsmanship Award. This is new this year. It's been voted on by the players and facilitators. It's given to an individual who exemplifies the attributes of good character, integrity, and just being a good teammate. So, for the winner of this award, let's just say that if this athlete's team is playing in the arena, you can hear her wherever you are. I've got a couple more good things to say about her first. <laughs> she takes her role as the team hype woman very seriously. And for all 15 of her games this season, she never took a night off from cheering on and uplifting her teammates. All right. So it's time to give love to the person who always gives others love. The Sportsmanship Award goes to guard number 63, 
CC Andrews. CC, I do have one more request from you. Can we get one more of these? So well deserved, CC. Next, we'd like to recognize the players who have been named to the 2022 Athletes Unlimited Basketball All Defensive Team. First, we'll start off with the forwards Isabel Harrison, Lauren Manis. Next, for the guards, Dijanae Carrington. Lexi Brown and center Nikki Green and from that incredible group of players we named the defensive player of the year now this award was voted on by players and members of the unlimited club so if you asked any captain this season what was a key to your success they're gonna say defense the Defensive Player of the Year makes her presence known on the court. Her interior D can shut down the best of players. Her size and basketball IQ allows her to get in passing lanes and pick apart the opposing offense. Congratulations to forward number two, Isabel Harrison. Well, first, Izzy, you got to come and get your hardware. <laughs> so in addition to that beautiful medal, Izzy will take home a $5,000 bonus. Izzy, you can go ahead and take your place at the podium. So now it's time to move on to those leaderboard awards. But before we start, we'd like to thank our friends at Bodden for providing the Bodden Assist this season. They're going to donate 100 basketballs to the charity of choice for our Defensive Player of the Year, Isabel Harrison, along with each of our top four finishers. A big thank you to Bodden Sports, the official basketball of Athletes Unlimited. So as we move into these litterboard um, winners, just remember these are for the quarter and team wins, their individual performances and MVP votes cast by players and Unlimited Club members. So let's get into your 2022 medalists. Finishing fourth on the leaderboard. This season gave athletes a chance to redefine themselves as ball players. And I don't think there's anyone who's done that quite like our fourth place finisher. This athlete has loved getting her chance to be a GM this season as a three-time captain. She'll forever be in the record books as scoring the first points of AU hoops and went on to average 14 points per game with 38 steals, 70 assists, and 33 pointers. Guard number four, Lexi Brown. This season, Lexi Brown played for Girl Rising as her cause. Next, we'll move on to our third place finisher. This is one, this athlete is one of six players in Athletes Unlimited history among all sports to be a four-time captain in the same season. That just never happens. She scored double digits in 12 of 15 games and her touch was true. She finished the season shooting 53.3%. She authored four double-double performances, averaging 7.2 rebounds and 17.6 points per game, 
forward, number two, Isabel Harrison. This season, Izzy played for the Lupus Foundation of America. Now we'll move on to second on the leaderboard. She drained 34 three-pointers. <laughs> but she also dished out a league-high 133 assists. She recorded the only triple-double in league history with 17 points, 10 rebounds, and 10 assists back in week three. Now here's what the stat sheet doesn't show. It's the fire she plays with every game, it's her leadership, and it's also her dance moves. There's no season leader for that, but we give it to you if we could. Congratulations to guard number nine, Natasha Cloud. So we mentioned in her stats how many threes Tosh knocked down this season. And we'd like to thank Aspiration for their support and the Trees for Threes program. Aspiration will commit 10 trees for every three-pointer made this season. So our athletes drained a total of 484 three-pointers over the past five weeks. So that means 4,840 trees will be committed. How about a round of applause for our long range shooters and for our partner, Aspiration. All right, it's the moment you've all been waiting for. Our first place finisher on the leaderboard. She is a force to be reckoned with. She'll pull up from three, drive to the basket, or box you out for a rebound, which is why she leads the league in stat points. As her teammates and opponents, game recognized game. You all voted her MVP more than any other athlete. So on her way to the top of the leaderboard, she pulled down a league leading 166 boards and is averaging a double-double on the season. She has shined with the gold team for the past three weeks as a captain with some help from her assistant GM, her son, Emmanuel. Let's give it up one more time for the inaugural Athletes Unlimited basketball season champion, forward number 21, Tiana Hawkins. Congratulations to all of our athletes on an incredible 2022 season. And with that, we get ready to close the Book of Unlimited for this inaugural basketball season. The calligrapher is inscribing our champion's name, as has been done for each of our champions across all sports. This book will travel on to Dallas next, where volleyball season two kicks off on March 16th. We've had so many great moments and memories here in Dallas. And as we leave you tonight, let's take one look back at the season. Thank you.
I'm excited. It's nothing that we've ever seen before. We are in the middle of doing something historical. It gives me butterflies to know that I will be a part of that first roster to ever start with Athletes Unlimited. This is for progressing women's sports, women in sport, and women in our sport forward. Not only have we arrived, but we are here to stay. Thank you so much. Enjoy the game. Brown with our first bucket in AU Hoops history. Team Russell gets the victory in the inaugural game. Yeah, we made it. Look at me, mom, I made it. Top of my game, I played it. Top, top of my game, not fade it. Stepping up, not stepping down. Tell my crew, I'm back in town. See my name is shining bright. See my name is shining light. That's just beautiful basketball. I won! An unreal week for Gianna Hawkins. I just love the heart she plays with, the toughness she brings. We playing a whole forest and we shooting all the three. Lexi Brown is planting trees. Up, not stepping down. Tell my crew I'm back in town. See my name is shining bright. See my name is shining lights. Step back, yeah, we run it, yeah, we're super choice. Step up, I be flying, see me over Mars. Yeah, we bad, yeah, we hype, yeah, we going far. Yeah, we run it, yeah, yeah we run it, yeah, we run it hard. Got some purple rain right now, cue up the prince. Ah! Long range, oh! it in! It's your world and we're just living in it. Step it up, just step it up, just step it up. Every quarter is important, every half, every game. So literally, every moment counts. Let's go! Step it up, just step it up. Any player can step up and get the job done for our team. And this is another classic Athletes Unlimited game. This truly is a player's yeah. league. Step back, yeah, we run it, yeah, we're super choice. Step up, I be flying, see me over Mars. Yeah, we bad, yeah, we hype, yeah, we going far. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, we run it, yeah, we run it, yeah, we run it. Hard. Triple double! Natasha Cloud, a history making moment. Colson from half court. For the oh! win! <laughs> Colson was gonna end this game no matter what. We will look back on this inaugural season and realize that we were a part of something huge.